Hey guys, welcome back and uh, we are going to be continuing our FNAF Fivory Realm. So the last time we made a door opening and closing down. Now um, I made a mistake, uh, you just have to make sure the door uh, before anything is on the same Z as over here. So this has to be 300, this has to be 300, just make sure. Anyway, we are going to be making a office. So, this is stupid, okay? We are going to remove the ground. So I'm gonna click on floor, delete. Now, uh, the way you make levels in Unreal is by geometry. So we're going to add a box. Now, um, I'm going to move this box. I'm gonna just move it to zero. And now, let's go to Let's just make it, uh, okay, let's make it hollow. This means there's a hole inside, there's a, there's space inside. Now um, let's go to geometry and switch to geometry editing. Now with this we can move around and uh, change up, um, change the scale. So I'm going to grab this face, move it, move it like this. Move it like this. Now you shouldn't be doing this uh, to uh, make uh, completed maps. This is just for prototyping. But I'm gonna still show it because it's a great tool to make basic levels. If you can't 3D model, so if you press play now, we are in this cool office. I may might make it a little smaller. Like this, maybe. You can just make it uh, however you want. Yeah, this is more like it. I'm still gonna make it a little smaller. Now uh, we've got our office. Now the next thing we want to do is make holes for our doors. So we're going to use box and uh, with this one we're going to check um, over here subtractive. Now we're going to scale this up so it's like this. I'm going to go to our geometry editing, grab one of the faces and drag it down. Nope. Okay, if this if this happens to you, you can just uncheck uh, this and it will move uh, smoother. So I'm going to just, just do this. This is kind of cool. So, yeah. I may, might make them a little bigger, I guess. Yeah, this is fine. So, uh, um, maybe a little bit like this. I don't know. Yeah, you can you can do anything you want. But uh, yeah, so now we have an office and uh, doors. So uh, we can go to our blueprints, grab the door blueprint we have, um, and just. Uh, make it however you want to so i'm going to okay so don't worry about it i'm going to just going to over here you can click on door you can scale it click select the door here and you can scale it up i'm going to unclick this so it's mover and just like this i'm going to move it up like this okay so Okay, so um, yeah, I'm going to move it like this up here. So it's uh, yeah. So if it closes, it's going to go. It's gonna do this. 
now um, yeah it's like this okay and uh, the button over here we're gonna select the button the button we want it to be over here yeah just like this nice so if we go over here we can interact this is going to be broken but uh, don't worry we're going to fix it so let's go back to our door blueprint now we have to change up some values now um, this will have to be a variable so I'm going to drag out and promote the variable now a new variable over here is going to appear I'm going to call this um, start location now this variable will store where the door begun right so um, we want to right click somewhere else and type begin play this will fire at s as soon as the door like starts existing right so we want to no uh, sorry we want to drag out our start location and set now uh, this drag out get actor location compound size so uh, what this means is um, now if we press play no um, this is wrong I'm sorry so instead we want to drag out our door get relative location yeah like this I'm stupid sorry this is how it's supposed to be now you can see it returns to its original position now the second part is going to be different we want our start location we want to right click and split struct pin now we're going to right click also here and split track pin and we're going to drag x y and z is going to be this minus um, three, uh, 300 yeah compile and save let me press play it looks great yeah now uh, this if we just use the door um, if we paste it over here uh, I'm just going to copy paste this just like this but uh, clearly I have to make this face smaller because it's ugly yeah something like this maybe even smaller okay so if you press E you can close the doors on the both sides and we have working doors nice so this is the first part of uh, making a five nights of freddy's uh, free roam game this is a pretty cool point now we have working doors and uh, the only thing we have to do is uh, make uh, animatronics in the next part we are going to be finishing uh, the office and after that we are going to be adding uh, yeah the animatronic so stay tuned and see you guys